Marshall here is doing a lot of videos with me today. Let's just be real. Um, You're going to be rules? binging on the Marshall. Yes. I'm sorry we didn't change our shirts, but who cares? Anyway, today we have a Rocks Box subscription box video. This is the second one that we've done. If you want to see the first one, I will link it above for you to see. Basically, Rocks Box, uh, if you don't know, is a $20 a month subscription service. Now, what's cool about this is it will give you three different things of jewelry. You can wear them for a month, um, so it's kind of like a rental service. But if at the end you choose that you to purchase, they will give it to you at a discount price, plus you get $10 a month credit to apply. So technically this box is only like $10 a month. That's really what you're paying if you choose to purchase, if you want to think about it that way. Um, every month you will have a stylist. I have noticed that uh, for every box you will have a stylist, but I've noticed it's a different one every time. Not always the same one. That's okay. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to go online and you're going to put a bunch of things that you're like that are in your wish list. Uh, you're going to put those in your list and then what's going to happen is your stylist will go in and pick like one thing from your wish list and then other things that kind of complement it of the same style. The first uh, box that I got, like I said, I wasn't really sure if I was going to continue this, but I ended up keeping this really long like black and gold necklace if you want to see it um, again it's up there um, but I wanted to show you what came in this one now uh, this is my second one I do get this for a month so even if I choose not to wear anything in this box I can immediately send it back and they will keep sending me back boxes as long as the month is going you can cancel anytime if you guys are wanting a free box there is a code down below to get your first box free if you send it back they will automatically charge you for your first month i'm just telling you that's how it works but on the other hand i think you know it's kind of a cool idea i don't know i i i'm just going to tell you just because my whole theory about subscription boxes is right now i have a couple that i do every month and have for years like loot crate birch box ipsy other boxes are one-off boxes so unless I like fall in love with it and can't do without it I'm probably not going to keep it um, and this is probably one of them because I like geek jewelry and this is not geek jewelry especially because this this is also a very tailored box it is uh, while uh, Ipsy and Birch box kind of keep some of the stuff that you want in mind, it's always stuff that you don't really know just yet. Exactly. Uh, and so I think those are those are really the ones that you're going to be wanting to do mm -hmm. on an often basis because that's going to introduce everybody to a it whole is. lot more product. Now I have to say that I did uh, realize that I really like the jewelry line House of Harlow because I really like retro jewelry I, a lot. So I think that's one of the things, and they did actually send me another House of Harlow item in here, um, so I'm excited about that. Anyway, my stylist name is Miriam and this is what she says she said I'm so glad you loved your last box I see that you've requested this great House of Harlow necklace so this was in my uh, wish list before I'm sending it your way and paired it with some great rhinestone studs I'm also sending a versatile lotus necklace to wear with them as well these items are all yours on loan while you decide what to keep and what to send back I hope you love wearing them all so then on the inside they give you a list of and you're not going to be able to see it because it's white and it's reflecting light very nicely but they have a list of all the items and um what the price is and then what your insider's price is so that your insider's price is the discount because obviously people have been wearing this um quite possibly and then they sterilize it and then they send it your way this is what the box looks like on the inside they seem which to is use very the same pretty wrapping paper. same wrapping paper um, which is fun. They got it in bulk. And of course, I don't know if I showed anybody this before and I'm going to cover it up, but they do have the return shipping label. So if uh, you want to send it back, they've already paid for postage and you just put everything in its original container and send it back with this on the outside of the bag that it came in, which is resealable. So it, it, you can use it twice when they, when you open it, when you get it, and then again when you send it off. So this is also awesome. They thought of... Do you send the box back with Yes, you do. Okay. So let's start with this House of Harlow necklace. I'm gonna give you this one so you can unwrap it while we're doing it. I'm gonna start with this one just because not only do I like the style, but I like the bag that it came in. It's really like nice. And the other one came in that bag too, like a bag like this, so I got to keep it. 
I really love this necklace. I do not love the price on this necklace. This price, the discounted price of this necklace is $70. I don't spend that much on jewelry to be honest, but I really like the style of it. There it is. It's got these really cute rhinestone triangles and it's super long. And then at the bottom of it, it has this triangle. Can you see that? Triangle with like a little chain at the bottom. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's gorgeous. It's silver and it has like some rhinestones on all the triangles. I love it. I love that it's a really long, I really love long necklaces a lot. Um, I really like this. And I, if it was not $70, I probably would buy it. If it was around like 20 or 30, I might purchase but not for 70 i don't think so so i'm gonna get some nice use wearing this a couple times this month before i send the box back what do you got? i have pulled out is there we go see if you can see that uh it's a teardrop shaped necklace um the the thing is and I, we had looked at this before mm -hmm. this is a really short chain it's so it ends up being a little bit more like a choker that's just going to go sitting there on the adam's apple that she doesn't have yeah and i so i am not crazy about this i'm probably not going to wear it at all but no. i like the style i have to say um this and this particular necklace is 44 dollars Again, I don't think this necklace is worth $44 to buy it, but I think that the simplicity of it all is really beautiful, so I do like that. Lastly, she has a pair of earrings. I think they're super cute, and they're posts, so that's what they look like. And I like them. I, I think they pair really nicely with the long necklace. They are small. I believe these cost $24 uh, for, for earrings i think that's steep i would probably pay oh, 15. yeah i mean i'd probably pay 15 for these but i don't know it's the rhinestone so um i would probably wear this as well maybe one day i'll wear the, the necklace and the earrings together so um i think that's cute but um for this box i don't think i'm going to keep anything in it i'm probably going to send it back and get maybe another box before my month is up so you might be seeing another one of these you might not it just depends on how i feel um but yeah that is our rocks box the second rocks box that we have gotten um if you guys know of any other like subscription services that are kind of jewelry based or anything like that make sure you tell us because we're like super willing to try it at least once that that i think that also has a, a calling that that needs to go out there yeah. and that there should be a geek jewelry subscription box there really should i mean we do loot crate accessories and that's kind of okay but not like this like can you imagine like the amount of like, geek jewelry that people would let purchase? me drop a concept on you you have a box kind of like this rocks box it contains at the very bottom of it a dvd of something that somebody might enjoy and a bunch of jewelry based around that theme so that then when you go and subscribe you go i want this series and they send you a box about that series. I think we can uh, we can kickstarter that. We get can kickstarter that. Yeah, we we go get get uh, get some independent jewelry makers like those you'd see on Artist Alley. Oh, you know that would be good. I you know what I just saw. Um, I love Anna Green Gables. A oh lot, yes. Because I was brought up on this, um, and I, I know like we have talked about it in the past. Like Corey likes to buy me jewelry based on different things I like. Like like last year uh, for I think our anniversary. He got me Downton Abbey necklace and earrings, mm -hmm. and so I found Anna Green Gables jewelry, yeah. and I was so excited. Really I was like, I jewelry. need this in my life. You know, I just I need. I actually this. I, I liked how one of them had that Celtic knot in there. In the yeah, world. it was really beautiful jewelry. Yeah, it really is. There was some cameos, and there was like a couple lockets and things like really of the time period, which I I love. Mm -hmm. So I mean, That's good stuff. yeah, I. I I just, I love this kind of thing. So I just like to keep accumulating in my collection. I do need a Back to the Future uh, earrings and necklaces super bad, and I haven't found any that I like yet, but that's my next accumulation. Also, Firefly, I need some Firefly stuff, Firefly Serenity stuff, um, that kind of thing. So, yeah, that should happen that's soon. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. Uh, anyway, uh, if you uh, really liked what you saw, make sure you give us a thumbs up, comment below, let us know. You know, we want to get to know you guys. I know a lot of people don't comment anymore, but whatever. You should do it. Yeah. Because we like talking to you. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and until next time, keep calm and stay zany. Bye-bye.
Bye.